Hello everyone! Welcome to Teacher Frail TV! Math 4, Quarter 1, Week 6 Milk Base Let's learn about Division of 3 to 4 digit numbers by 10,100 or 1,000 without and with remainder Lesson 2 After going through this lesson, you are expected to Divide 3 to 4 digit numbers by 10,100 or 1,000 with and without remainder Hello kids! Today, we are going to study about division of 3 to 4 digit numbers by 10,100 or 1,000 without and with remainder Let's start our lesson by doing the following activities. Learning Task 1 Match the division sentence with its answer. Number 1 4,000 divided by 10 is? Very good! The answer is? Letter C, 400. Number 2 5,000 divided by 100 is? Very good! The correct answer is letter B, 50. Number 3, 4,100 divided by 10 is? Very good! The correct answer is letter D, 410. Number 4, 6,500 divided by 100 is? Very good! The correct answer is letter F, 65. Number 5, 7,800 divided by 100 is? Very good! The correct answer is letter A, 78. And number 6, 24,000 divided by 1,000 is? Very good! The correct answer is letter E, 24. Read and analyze the example problem. Observe the quotient if the divisor is 10,100 and 1,000. The Boy Scouts of the now elementary school initiated the collection of 2,318 canned goods to be given to 10 poor families affected by Typhoon Leo. How many pieces of canned goods should each family receive? So we're going to divide 2,318 canned goods divided by 10 poor families. 2,318 divided by 10 is equals to 231 remainder 8. Try to observe. The digits of the dividend is exactly the same with the first three digits of the quotient. 231 is the first digit of the dividend. And the first three digits of the quotient is also 231. So they are exactly the same. Remainder, which is 8, is also the same digit of the last digit of the dividend, 8. Here is another example using 100 as divisor. 2,318 divided by 100 equals 23 remainder 18. The first two digits of the dividend, 2, 3, is exactly the same with the first two digits of the quotient, 23. Remainder, which is 18, is also the same digits of the last two digits of the dividend, 18. Here is another example using 1,000 as divisor. 2,318 divided by 1,000 equals 2 remainder 318. The first digit of the dividend, which is 2, is exactly the same with the first digit of the quotient, 2. 
remainder which is 318 is also the same digit of the last three digits of the dividend 318 the number of digits in the remainder is based on the number of zeros in the divisor. So the number of zeros in the divisor are 3. The number of digits of the remainder is also 3 digits. Learning task 2. Find the quotient. So the divisor of this table is in the middle. 10. First, divide. 4,510 divided by 10 equals, very good, 451. Next, 226 divided by 10 equals, very good, 22 remainder 6. Next, 3,460 divided by 10 equals, very good, 346. Next, 865 divided by 10 equals Very good! 86 remainder 5 Next, 784 divided by 10 equals Very good! 78 remainder 4 Next, 3761 divided by 10 equals Very good! 376 remainder 1 Next, 843 divided by 10 equals Very good! 84 remainder 3 And last, 5,461 divided by 10 equals Very good! 546 remainder 1 For this table, the divisor is 100 so first, we're going to divide 7,561 divided by 100 equals Very good! 75 remainder 61 Next, 8,423 divided by 100 equals Very good! 84 remainder 23 Next, 9,360 divided by 100 equals Very good! 93 remainder 60 Next, 543 divided by 100 equals Very good! 5 remainder 43 Next, 650 divided by 100 equals Very good! 6 remainder 50 Next, 6,542 divided by 100 equals Very good! 65 remainder 42 Next, 4,014 divided by 100 equals Very good! 40 remainder 14 Next, 3,430 divided by 100 equals very good! 34 remainder 30 And next, for this table, the divisor is 1,000 Let's divide first 1,234 divided by 1,000 equals Very good! 1 remainder 234 Next, 5,678 divided by 1,000 equals very good! 5 remainder 678 Next, 9,000 divided by 1,000 equals Very good! 9 Next, 2,143 divided by 1,000 equals Very good! 2 remainder 143 Next, 8,999 divided by 1,000 equals Very good! 8 remainder 999 Next, 3,322 divided by 1,000 equals Very good! 3 remainder 322 Next, 6,789 divided by 1,000 equals 
Very good! 6 remainder 789 Next, 7860 divided by 1000 equals Very good! 7 remainder 860 In dividing 3 to 4 digit numbers by 10 with remainders, the last digit in the dividend is the remainder while the remaining digits represent the quotient. In dividing 3 to 4 digit numbers by 100 with remainder, the 2 digits in the dividend is the remainder while the remaining digits represent the quotient. In dividing 3 to 4 digit numbers by 1000 with remainder, the 3 digits in the dividend is the remainder while the remaining digit represents the quotient. And for our last activity learning task 3, find the quotient. Number 1. 5,386 divided by 1,000 will give you a remainder of A. 86 B. 36 C. 386 or D. 6 What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is Letter C. 386 is the remainder. Number 2 650 is equals to how many tens? A. 600 B. 60 C. 65 or D. 0 What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is Letter C. 65 There are 65 tens. Number 3 9,500 has how many thousands? A. 8 B. 950 C. 900 or D. 9 What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is Letter D. 9 There are 9 thousands Number 4 There are 9,020 canned goods to be placed equally inside 100 boxes. How many canned goods will each box hold? A. 60 B. 96 C. 90 or D. 80 What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is letter C. 90 And number 5 If the divisor is 15 and the dividend is 1,565 What is the quotient? A. 104 B. 104 remainder 33 C. 104 remainder 5 or D. 105 What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is Letter C. 104 remainder 5 is the quotient Kids, are your all answers correct? Wow! Good job! Remember in dividing 3 to 4 digit numbers by 10 with remainders, the last digit in the dividend is the remainder while the remaining digit represents the quotient. In dividing 3 to 4 digit numbers by 100 with remainder, the 2 digits in the dividend is the remainder while the remaining digits represent the quotient. And in dividing 3 to 4 digit numbers by 1000 with remainder, the 3 digits in the dividend is the remainder while the remaining digits represent the quotient. Kids, I hope you learned a lot from this lesson. Until our next topic, bye-bye! Thanks for watching!